to continue with the tutorial demonstration about uh, using the Ocean KG UV920 piece remote control function I will be covering this time uh, remote changing of the transceiver settings one of the settings that you could remotely change on the U Ocean KG UV 920P is the frequency. So, the frequency. Now, looking back at the flowchart that I have uh, prepared, okay. so you could change the frequency of the Ocean, you could also change the channel number change the repeater mode, change the transmitting power, change the reception CTCS tone or change the RXDCS tone. Okay, for this uh, particular uh, video I will be covering changing the frequency. Okay. Note that from this flowchart you could only change do or you could only do remote changing of the transceiver settings after you have done activation of the remote control changing functions and this is only uh, required after you have done manual activation of the UV 920 piece RCSW functions okay. so before you could do all of this you must first do this proceed to uh, instruction B and that's the only time you can do all of these things not unlike the remote stun or remote power off or power on which is only uh, possible after you have done the one-time activation so that's our flowchart there so for changing the frequency Manual activation of the KG UV920 piece RCSW via menu 44. Now, to do that, the following procedures must be uh, followed. Okay, so, you have to hold the SP mic of the KG UV920P and then press menu 44. After that, you press menu again to enter the selection and from the options you choose on using either the up or down button and then to confirm the selection press menu okay. the transceiver will then reboot or restart with both sides locked so let's try it so here is our uh, ocean we powered it on So now in frequency mode, we have the following uh, operating frequencies for the side A. For side A, we have 466.120 and 155.180 on side B. So the master frequency display icon is currently at side B, indicating that 155.180 will be our master frequency okay. now to activate RCSW you hold the SP mic press menu 4 I'm sorry it's menu 4 4 RCSW press menu again choose uh, on and then confirm with the menu Okay. The KGUV920P restarted with both sides locked. Okay. Now we could proceed with instruction B from the flowchart. So we are done with this. And then we proceed to this activation of the remote control changing functions this time using a handheld transceiver so 
we are going to use now our handheld transceiver I Baofeng UV5R in this case with the master frequency dialed in okay, as our operating frequency to activate the remote control changing functions you hold the PTT button of the radio controller so in our case the Baofeng UV5R and then you key in the control code plus the RC COCO code and then release the PTT button after releasing the button you will then hear a single beep on the radio controller okay. so take note that the uh, control code, code control code that we are going to use is one two three one two three and then we have to terminate it with the pound key and then for the RCCOCO code we use menu down button so menu down button corresponds to keys A and C on the software from the uh, previous video that I have shown to you okay so in other words for the procedure B or activation of the remote control changing functions the keys that we are to press are 1, 2, 3, pound, menu, down okay so after doing this that is the only time that we could proceed with the remote changing of transceiver settings see we are done with this we are now at trying to accomplish this and after that you have to follow it up with either changing the frequency change channel number etc so this first before you can go here and then you have, you have to go back again and then do that again but you have to skip this procedure A okay so let's now do it on the uh, master I mean the radio controller so the code is one two three pound menu down okay. menu down okay so there's that beep okay take note that there is a timeout so after 30 seconds of no code uh, inputs it would time out so you have to do that procedure once again so after doing it we could now go to remote changing of the transceiver settings so to change the frequency okay, we have just uh, done procedures one we already heard the beep and now you hold the PTT of the transceiver you key in 01 and then key in the 8 digit frequency and then release the PTT button you will then hear a beep on the controller and the KGUV920P will restart with the frequency you have just specified you cannot change to the frequencies of your master frequency what that means is since the master frequency is using uh, 155.180 a UHF frequency you cannot change to another UHF um, I mean another VHF frequency so one has to be in VHF and the other one has to be in UHF okay so let's try it procedure B 001 8 digit code so let's say for example we wish to change from 466.120 to 400.0000 to do that we do the following press the push to talk one two three pound menu down release the button single beep PTT again zero one and then the eight digit frequency two three four five six seven eight release there's that beep 
and then the KG UV 920P changed from 466.120 now this time to 400.00000 so that's 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 digits okay so let's do that once again so to change from 400 to let's say 466.120 we have to do what do this first and proceed as uh, mentioned okay. so that's push to talk one, two, three. So here you heard that beep. And then within 30 seconds, you have to uh, key in the frequency. The code first is 01 to change frequency. And now the new frequency. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Release the button. And it should say 466.120 there it is 466.120 so what would happen if we key in a frequency from the same uh, the, the same frequency same frequency from our with our master uh, frequency here so for example one 36.00 now let's check it let's check it out and see what happens so 3 pound release okay push the talk again 01 to change frequency this time let's try 136 678 that's 136 nothing happens Okay, no beep does not reboot because it's VHF we keyed in a VHF frequency when we are using as our master frequency also a VHF frequency so it only has to be so it would only work if we key in a UHF frequency because the master frequency is that in VHF okay so let's try say from 466.120 to uh, 44 or so 435.123 let's try it zero one four Three three one two three zero zero. See? Works. Now go back to four six six dot one two zero. You do one two three pound ones again. One hmm. please. Okay. Within 30 seconds, key in the new frequency 4661200 because that's 8 digits. Reboots and 466120 that is. Okay. Question Can we use the frequency on side A? Now let's try it. So I have here another Baofeng with uh, 466.120 in frequency mode. Frequency mode. Okay, there you have it. Frequency mode. Let's try one, two, three. There's no beep. Okay. About. Do it again. It won't work because we only have to do it on the master frequency. 
and since we chose a VHF frequency as the master frequency then we can only shift to a UHF frequency on side A okay. we can use this to control that okay. so that's basically how uh, remote changing of the transceiver settings or changing the frequency of the KGUV920P is accomplished. So thanks a lot for watching. Maraming salamat po.